Hello, this is Bishop Doherty again. Somebody asked the question, what are subsidiarity and solidarity and what do these have to do with me? Like so many other elements of church life, uh, these things describe certain relationships and certain functionality. Um, subsidiarity is a theological term as well as a practical term. It means to handle things at the lowest governance level possible. So if there's something that can be handled in your own parish, it shouldn't be kicked up to the bishop. Uh, and this, this is to encourage participation of people at every level. So um, very often uh, the parish pastoral council, the parish finance council is a great place to make certain decisions. Other types of parish decisions, uh, like to build a new church building, requires kicking that up a couple of levels for analysis and um, inspection especially. Um, solidarity means that we are all of a part in the communion of the church and solidarity is a strength, sticking up for each other, defending the church, uh, trying to come to a shared point of view on things, especially regarding charity, uh, that help us in our life as a church. Um, there are a couple of uh, sayings we hear that are against solidarity, a house divided against itself cannot stand, and so that's why the church promotes solidarity, a, a phrase that some of you became familiar with during the revolution in Poland under Lech Walesa. Uh, Benjamin Franklin also had something to say about solidarity, and I have to read the quote, we must indeed all hang together, or most assuredly, we shall all hang separately. Those are lessons about solidarity. So it's important to hang together. And those are important words right now in a time that's become a little bit more contentious. So um, before we level criticisms at, at, at other people uh, and make known some of our dissatisfactions, we have to account for the solidarity that we have. And am, am I helping or hurting the solidarity uh, of the church, which of course is a very valuable tool for its mission to preach the gospel and to save souls. Thank you very much.